hello there welcome back to my channel so i am welcoming you from a different angle uh, today i am doing my shop my stash uh, rotation usually what i do is i sit down and i talk to you about the stand-up products of uh, the month however this time around i'm just being a little bit uh, lazy and i'm just gonna go straight into the uh, selection of the products. So, if you're interested in seeing what I'm going to pick for the month of July to uh, use, then just keep on watching. Okay, so I had figured out that I can actually extend, extend my tripod even further than uh, usual. So I can actually, you know, have my camera on a tripod rather than holding it in my hand. You can see me <laughs> right there. Okay, so uh, primer. I definitely want to uh, use this. This is my Smashbox smash Photo Finish um, Primerizer. This is my second bottle. I had the uh, mini. I used it all up and then I bought the full size. I really, really uh, like it. So this is going into my box, which I have right here. I'll just show you. So I have my uh, Project Pan products, uh, you know, some staples and also this eyeshadow palette that I'm testing out at the moment. Uh, a friend gave it to me. It's the Makeup Forever Artist Artist uh, shadow, uh, eyeshadow palette. So I'm just uh, testing that out. So that goes into the box. I also want to use this this month this is the catrice hd uh, liquid coverage uh, foundation my one has separated because i haven't used it in a while i have my one in the shade rose beige it is a little bit too dark for me at the moment but i think i am going to um self tan so this will be uh, perfect for that i really love this foundation full coverage modifying just really really good then for my concealer I bought two more concealers, you guys. <laughs> I am absolutely crazy. I bought this one. This is the Lacura Take Cover uh, Concealer. So this is supposed to be a um, dupe for <laughs> Shape Tape. I got that. And also, I got this. This is another Lacura Concealer. This is the Radiant Concealer, which is supposed to be a dupe for the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. So, as you can see, a lot of concealers. Uh, but... This, one, this is the one that I want to use uh, this month. Uh, this is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Uh, I have so little left. I'm literally about here. I think I'm about to take out the stopper because, as you can see, the wand is getting coated, but not too well. So, yeah, I am hoping that I'll be able to use this up uh, this month month and then you know at least my concealer numbers will go down so this is going into my box and then for powder i have only have two powders this is the rimmel stay matte powder uh, this is a pressed powder i tried it uh for the second time last month i had it before when i was a teenager i really enjoyed it and i'm glad to have it back in my collection so yeah i just want to use this throughout the month it's great for setting underneath uh, the eyes and also all around the face it's an all around good uh, sort of powder and then for my brows so let's take a look i didn't add any new brow products thankfully this is still unopened this is still unopened and this is still unopened because as you can see i have these ones open which i really really want to use uh, up so let's take a look lacquer catrice color puff i think i'm gonna go with the lacquer this month uh, this is the brand from aldi this is just a dupe for like the gimme brow look at this really really tiny uh brush i enjoy using it uh yeah and you know uh, eventually hopefully one day i'll be able to use up all of these like this one is on his last leg like there's so little of it left but you can still coat my eyebrows because i don't necessarily have that much eyebrows so it's just annoying that um it's still there okay for bronzers and cream products i guess so this is what i have in this box 
So I only have two cream bronzers. I have the Loritzi stick and also my Chanel Soleil Tan de Chanel, but I used the Chanel one last month. This is how much I have left. I really want to use this up this month and then go ahead and buy myself the uh, Huda Tantor. But yeah, hopefully, I think I will be able to uh, use this up this month. Oh, I am so excited. I really like this. This is nice, but you know, I'm kind of getting bored of it. I want to try something new. So, and I don't want to declutter. I prefer to use things up. So yeah, this is going into this month's rotation. And then for cream uh, blush i have the one from my uh, whole collection project pan so i won't be pulling a new one in however for a cream uh, highlight this is brand new to me this month this is the illamasqua beyond liquid highlighter in the shade omg and i am just going to kill my dog mango uh-uh <laughs> uh she loves that plant. My friend gave it to me and I'm trying to care for it. But my freaking dog wants to just eat it, okay? Oh, and I have like my Dyson here because she's making a mess when she goes near that plant. You know, I'm trying to keep her away from it, but oh, it's getting hard. It's getting hard. Anyway, this is the Elamasca Beyond Liquid uh, Highlighter. Brand new, unopened, as you can see. Uh, yeah, so I oh, I'm so excited for this. Uh, I have two. I have three liquid highlights now. I have the uh, Super Shock. I have the Essence, which is on its last leg also, and then I have this. So it's really nice to try something new, and I can't wait. Uh, yeah, I can't wait to put this on my face. Okay, so let's uh, talk about powder products. Now, I am not going to choose any individual uh, highlights, blushes, or bronzers because. I want to try this. This is the Smashbox Cali Contour Palette. I bought this about two months ago and I've only swatched it so far. But this is how it looks. Oh, it looks so beautiful. So you have a contour, a bronzer, uh, two highlights, one blush and one setting powder. So I just want to dive into this and give this my 100% because it just looks so, so beautiful. So yeah, I can't wait. And look at this mirror, so freaking beautiful. Can't wait to put this on my face. Oh, I heard so many good things about this. My eyeliners are in this uh, box. And um, I was thinking that I want to grab this purple one from Essence. But actually, I changed my mind. And... Oh, oh, oh. That's okay. <laughs> and I want to grab my Huda Beauty uh, liner. It is a double-ended liner, so on one side you have the pencil, which looks like this, just, you know, your typical kind of black pencil. And then on the other side you have the liquid liner. The liquid liner I had um, in my whole collection project pan. This is not the one <laughs> that I want to use. I want to use this just normal black um eyeliner because I haven't used it in a while and yeah just want to make some uh, progress on it and you know it's a nor it's like a neutral color that will go with any eyeshadows that I put into my pandos uh, eyeshadows and especially it will go well with the uh, makeup forever uh, eyeshadow palette that I was given so yeah this is going in and then my liquid shadows are in this little box uh, for someone who doesn't wear liquid eyeshadow as much, I have a lot. Let me take a look at what I want. This is still unopened. I don't want to open it until I finish one up. And oh my guys, let me show you something. I am so freaking close to finishing this. Do you see the windows? Like this is all that's left in here and probably only this much is reachable. <gasps> Oh, if this gets rolled into a project, I will be so happy. But anyway, this is not what we're going to focus on. And uh, this is the PS Liquid Glitter Eyeshadow. So this is supposed to be like a dupe for, you know, the Stila Glitter and Glows. This is from Penny's. And uh, this is what it looks like. I thought it was dried out, but still a lot of product here and it's not drying out whatsoever so <laughs> i am gonna put this into my basket this month and just get some work on it okay then it is time for some lip 
products. So let me just move this here and let me kind of move out a little bit. Okay, so this is my lip collection and oh my god, okay, these two I bought recently. This is the YSL Volupte lip balm and this is the Becca, what is it called? Uh, a lip gloss. Ah, so beautiful. I tried them on my, um, uh, I tried them on my lips for a couple of times and I have been loving it but I do want to use something else and the something else for gloss I want that I want to use is this and this is the Huda Beauty lip strobe and I have my one in the shade snobby so it is just a very very metallic pink sort of lip gloss very very thick i don't mind it it's not bad but it's a mini so i want to get some uh work on it done so that i can eventually you know use it up and then for my normal lipsticks which are here i want to use this Ooh, let's just put that straight so it doesn't annoy people so this is the Bourjois Rouge Velvet the lipstick and I have my one in the shade 02 as you can see and this is what it looks like so a beautiful sort of um, rosy color and guys this is how much I've left come on I really 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 need to get on using up some lipsticks I have that wet and wild lipstick in my whole collection project pan I am close but not that close I still have like maybe two months of you know uh, product left so there's still time for that but yeah I just want to you know give this um, a little a little something right and then for my liquid lipstick because I haven't chosen a liquid lipstick yet so these are my Huda liquid lipstick these are my crayons these are the other liquid uh, lipsticks let's take a look oh okay this one I was gonna go with the Huda but oh my god this is my Kylie Mash liquid lipstick in the shade Dolce K uh, Dolce K yeah so let me just give it a sniff because Oh, it still smells so, so good. So, yeah, it is a nudish kind of dark brown uh, on me, at least, uh, lipstick. So, yeah, that is going in to the freaking basket. And I actually have a corresponding lip liner. So, just let me just find it, okay? Found it. Corresponding lip liner here, as you can see. Uh, Dolce K. There you go. And yeah, I'm gonna put that in the basket because I like to match my lip liners to my lipstick. This is the whole basket right here. A lot of new stuff. I can't wait to try this. Oh, I'm so, so excited. But yeah, this is what it's looking like. We have uh, some old stuff, some new stuff to try out and I'm just so excited. Uh, but yeah, that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give this uh, video a like. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Mm.